I'm excited to meet your dad. Uh oh, no, wait a second. Okay, I do have to warn you. My dad's been a little eclectic since the divorce. So you're just gonna have to go a little easy on him, okay, baby? I don't know what eclectic means, but we'll be okay. Uh Look who it is. Kelly. Well, dinner is almost ready. Come on. Thank you. <laughs> ah, this is nice. Your dad seems really nice. Thank you for taking it easy. Dinner's ready, so come grab your plates. Let's eat. Well, we're having seafood tonight. Seafood diet. We see food and eat it. Ah, we're just kidding. Having our family favorite hot dog soup. Everybody loves this around our house. Oh my God, babe, this was like my favorite food growing up. What's in it? It's hot dog and water. Yeah. Phones go in the bowl. Phones go in the bowl. I know you know this one. Phones go in the bowl. Every week, put your phones in the bowl, and then I'm gonna pass. We're gonna piece of paper, and we're gonna write our passcodes down. And we're gonna put our phones in the bowl so they're not disturbing our meal this evening. You got it, Dad. Dad, can I get a straw? Of course. Let me get my pocket straw for my favorite daughter. Thank you. Pocket straw for my new son-in-law. And underwear straw for me. Do you, do you think I can maybe get a spoon? To eat this with, do you think? Son, I need to talk with you in the other room. Yeah, all right. We should. Son, this recipe has been in our family for generations. I want you to know that. My grandmother's grandmother taught her how to make it. My grandmother's where I learned how to eat it. You eat the mushy hot dog with your hands, with your fingers. And then you suck down the water, the broth, really, with the pocket straw that I have such provided. What? So you don't use a spoon at any point? I'm so I don't really. I'm not trying to insult your heritage. Or... Okay. You mentioned spoon in my house around hot dog broth again. I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. Isn't this it is just a time honored tradition in our family? Isn't it just hot dog water? I mean, I'm not you are to... on thin, fucking, ice. Amigo, comprende? The ice is fucking razor thin. I'm sorry. You could fart on it and it would break. I'm not mad at you, son. Everything's good. Thank you. I appreciate yeah. it. Alfred. I want you to be nice to my daughter and treat her kindly. You're a good kid. <clears throat> we got a couple rules around here, just five, pretty easy to follow. We got loyalty. Integrity, good deeds, good diet. My dad and his rolls. Yeah, it sounds like four. Phones go in the bowl, son. Phones go in the bowl. Phones go in the bowl at the dinner table. Phones go in the bowl. Phones go in the bowl. Phones go in the bowl when we're at the dinner table. Son, do you understand me? Let's put that phone. All right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Got your Facebooking out. Got your Snapchat now so you can have a dinner time with the family. Yeah. I'm going to go to the bathroom. Cool off. Do a neti pot. Eat a carrot, maybe. Excuse me.
Babe, you really shouldn't do that. He's gonna go anal if he finds out. It's gonna be okay, babe. Did you finish your soup already? Uh, yeah. You could not leave me alone with that it's and expect like me not to eat minutes. it. It's hot dog water, babe. Mm. It was so good. I had to finish it in the bathroom. Delicious. Now, as long as everybody's phones are in the bowl, we should be good. I feel like you guys should know. I, I just got a text from my friend. Text. Well, no, you need to know, but there's a problem. No, there's an no. Murderer. Problem. The problem is, murderer. I have five rules, son. The problem. I know your five rules. You said them earlier. Just We listen. don't believe in fake news conspiracy media, Clinton. Unmask our children. Election fraud integrity. Babe, aren't you going to eat your food? Oh, fuck. Okay. Sure. That took me six hours. Son, I got five rules in this house. They're very simple. If your phone goes off again during this meal, I will hang the family goldfish at our children's school. Are you even finishing your soup, son? Listen, there's an axe murderer. Axe murderer! is a liberal conspiracy. We have five rules in this house, son. Five rules. Open your throat. Breathe through your nose. Eye contact. What the fuck are you talking about? The biggest one of all, do not gag. Great dinner. What? Now that it's over, I've just got five final rules for you. To take with you in your daily life. Arizona State University. Four. Immigrants. Stop! What? What the fuck are you talking about, man? Let me finish. No, I'm done, man. Fuck you. Fuck your rules, five. babe. You know I love you. I'll five. never forget Miami, Florida. You throwing up on my ASU hoodie, but. I'm done, man. I'm done. You're... I'm done. My last two rules are thyroidism and dude. pulmonary Goodbye. emphysema. Grandma's a whore. <laughs> yeah, I mean, overall, how was I supposed to know she was 14 and, like, I... I, she, I, I mean, kinda... And I don't know. Phil, we're live. She was asking for it, too. Hello, I am Phil My Butt, and right here, we are in front of the house where an axe murdering occurred of a father and daughter. And also, coming up, age of consent for animals? Is it a thing? Is it not? Is it legal in your state? We'll be right back after this.